The following is a summary of the Holy Father's words this morning. Dear brothers and sisters, in our continuing catechesis for this holy year of mercy, we now consider the first of Jesus' miracles, the changing of water into wine at the wedding feast of Cana. St. John fittingly calls these miracles signs, for by them the Lord reveals the Father's merciful love. Jesus' choice of a wedding feast points to the deeper meaning of this miracle. It is a sign of the new covenant that he came to inaugurate, the messianic banquet promised for the end times, where he is the bridegroom and the church his bride. By changing the water kept for ritual purification into new wine, Jesus signals that he is the fulfillment of the law and the prophets. Mary's command to the servants, do whatever he tells you, can serve as a program of life for the church. We are called constantly to renew our love for the Lord and to draw new wine, new life from his saving wounds. The miracle at Cana reminds us that we are invited as members of the Lord's family, the church, to draw near to him in faith and thus to share in the joy of the wedding feast of the new and eternal covenant. Saluto i pellegrini di lingua inglese presenti all'odierna udienza, specialmente quelli provenienti da Inghilterra, Scozia, Francia, Paesi Bassi, Cina, India, Indonesia, Malaysia, Singapore e Stati Uniti d'America. Con fervi di auguri che il presente giubileo della misericordia sia per voi e per le vostre famiglie un tempo di grazia e del rinnovamento spirituale, invoco su voi tutti la gioia e la pace del Signore Gesù. I greet the English-speaking pilgrims and visitors taking part in today's audience, particularly those from England, Scotland, France, the Netherlands, China, India, Indonesia, Malaysia, Singapore, and the United States of America. With prayerful good wishes that the present Jubilee of Mercy will be a moment of grace and spiritual renewal for you and your families, I invoke upon all of you joy and peace in our Lord Jesus Christ. Dominus obiscum, et con spiritu tuo, sit nomen Domini benedicta, et sol nunc et usque in seculum, aiutere in nostro in nomine Domini, qui fegi celum et terram. Benedica vos, omnipotens Deus, Pater, Filius, et Spiritus Santos. Amen. Amen.